Hello and welcome. Um, as you know, there was no video yesterday. I was out in town, so we are looking today at what is the ultimate dynasties. As you see, they've picked as the Starmen, Haaland, Zidane and Maldini. Obviously, three people who have relatives who are also involved in football. Um, Zidane's son, Haaland's dad and Maldini's, well, son and dad, I guess, really. Um, but they are obviously star men, um, the face of this promo, should we say. And there was a bit of content. There are icons related to this as well. So the Zidane and Maldini are joined by Rivaldo, Haji, Veron, Clivert and Larson, all who have sons. As you can see, Maldini there straight in front of us on the screen. So yeah, there is, it's, it's a good looking... Um, bunch of players involved there's also some player of the month that i missed out on yesterday harry Maguire and pablo dybala for the premier league and for um Serie A. obviously after today's results harry Maguire won't be looking so happy with his player of the month thing but there you go so let's have a look through and see what we have today in the various different sections we also had a new evo yesterday which was a good, ooh, that's a tricky choice. I'm probably going to go with the 20, but it is a tricky one. Um, we also had a new Eva, ooh, we've got this. Sorry, I'm ooing all over the shop here. So we have the new, um, in two days time, so that's Monday evening. You have to watch at least 15 minutes and at least 60 minutes. And then the 18th, so a week later, another 60 minutes which is fine like we said before just keep the stream up in the background of your computer or on your phone don't have to have the volume up don't actually have to watch it just have to have it open and playing so they get the viewing numbers that they're after which is the main reason that they involve um e-stream stuff on here but yeah as you can see it's got instructions in the top right hand corner um up here i don't know if you can see my mouse but up here just under the xp under the coin balance and then it's got details elsewhere. So it's all over the shop about how to actually get that done. Um, out of FC Pro, Champions Bonus is there. Radioactive is still there. We'll get, we won't get a day to, for tomorrow then. Um, that comes tomorrow for door number 10. Radioactive Cup, we're not bothering with. We've got the Ultimate Dynasty's Daily Objective, which is play a game and score a goal, basically. Play one match to earn Pablo, Pablo Maldini on a two-game loan, and then you use him to do this here. So one more game, we'll get uh, Daniel Maldini, and then we have to score in four separate matches, which means we'll do one of these today. So we'll get one of this, that finished, and then we'll get one more here, and then the rest happen in the next few days, as you can tell. Uh, level 26, we are not there, surprisingly. Um, and then milestones, we're up to... 53 out of 60, which is progress. It's going in the right direction, obviously. Um, but yeah, it will take a while to get through. But we're getting some good cards from it. Um, yeah, I might as well just show you. I got a couple of... Um, just doing some SPCs today. Managed to pick up a couple of these um, cards. So let's just show you. Just, just to show you that they are actually packable just by doing SPCs and doing the upgrades. Um... There you go. Got Taram, the Inter Milan striker. Looks like a decent card. One of those ones with big jumping and big strength. Um, Schlotterbeck and Oberdorf. I think that's it. Yeah, just those three. Yeah, just those three. So yeah, three of them in a, in a day is pretty good. Quite happy with that, to be honest. And quite surprised, really. Um, while we're in here, let's go into Evolutions. We had a new one yesterday, so I would be very surprised. If... But there you go. I am very surprised. We do have one today. Um, and a defender that can be up to 80... Up to 87. So this is... A... They've picked an 82 rated card there that will go up to an 84. So overall, it's... Um, ups the defensive work rate to high. Gives three passing, one dribbling, one defending, and one physical. And then gives three pace, two dribbling, 
three defending and three physical and intercept plus play style. Intercept plus is big, so it's prob- it's going to be worth picking... Your, your best one is probably going to be a player that doesn't have the intercept play style at all. Therefore, getting it is a big thing. But <laughs> it's mad that Jess Fish, uh, Fishlock here, the Welsh lady midfielder, I've already upgraded her with the precision one. She was a really good card to upgrade. You already have an evolution, so I can't do that evolution again. Didn't realise that was the case. I guess it's a... Oops. I guess it's going to be the same with Rabio. Yeah. So you can't get the same evolution twice. I did not realise that at all. So it's for a central... It's for a midfielder. So to Brits would go... Up to an 86... Well, so wait a minute, 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 wait a minute. So it's a rare defender upgrade, and yet... It's there's no positional requirements, so you could get a striker with sixty two defending. So defending has to be be between sixty one and eighty five. So I could actually get a striker. Are there any strikers I've got here? A card like a McAllister, no. The Fishlock one would be good. The De Brits one is okay, but we may look through and see. Because the pace you can go up to 83, I would be looking for somebody with the higher pace to make the most of it. We'll see. We'll have a look on um, Footbin and the other websites. But yeah, Rare Defender upgrade there for 150,000 coins or 750 um, FIFA points, should you be that way inclined. The Intercept Playstyle Plus is... Big. It's like that's an anticipate are massive ones for defensive elements of the game and the high defensive work rate as well. And the fact that you can put this on a card that's up to 87 as well, they're going to be some useful big cards that can be evolved here. Whether it's worth it is, I'm not sure. That's entirely up to yourself. How it fits into your team, your club, um, how you're playing the game, yeah, just, just work it out for yourself. But there, as you can see, it's not positional locked, so it's not, it's not positional locked or positional, what's the word, what's the word I'm looking for, restricted, as in you can't, not a player who is not a left wing or something like that, or not has to be a defender, just any particular position. Um, so what else have we got here? Uh, but the players. Hernandez was new the other day, we still got Griezmann, we still got Salah, we still got Correa. Still got Bamiang, Skriniar, Caicedo, Buladia, Frank Kikowski in the Radioactive series over there. Triple Threat Trio of Forlan, Santos, and Amoso are still there. Still there. 12 days left. Two weeks. Oh, we have a new Justin Clivert. He is. There's the Harry Maguire. I've done the Dabala over here somewhere. Somewhere. Um, but yeah, that's Harry Maguire. He's an 84 and an 85. As you can see, no team of the week involved. Uh, Trier was there, added there before. Benekasir was there before. So, Justin Clivert. That's quite similar to Anthony Gordon card, to be honest. Except playstyles. He's got Rapid. He's got Flair playstyle plus got the Traveller. Traveller is nice. The pace is solid, and yet, because it's 93-93, you can still add something like a Hawk, or add something like an Engine, and still have that effect of the boost. It's fairly well done. The composure and reactions are a little lower like everything else. As we normally see with the, the lighter weight wingers. He is left mid. He is right mid. And he is right wing. Four star, four star as well. The work rate is right around. He really does look like his dad as well. Which obviously doesn't have any impact on the card. But there we go. So 383 with a Premier League. And 84 with a team of the week. Gold pack and a small prime electrum. So, yeah, if you're interested in that kind of thing, if you think an 86 Clivert's could improve your team out on the wing, then go for it. If you've got duplicates, like if you open a pack and you've got four duplicate 83s or something like that, it might be worthwhile doing this 83 rated section and then going from there. But yeah, that's what there. So, new evolution, new Clivert. What else do we have? 
Mixed League, Bronze League. We've got the Daily Gold again. This is the 11 players, which is good value. So put your bronzes, put your silvers in and get your gold out of that. Obviously, you can pack special cards out of that as well, which is a really good option. Um, I got a Team of the Week out of one I did yesterday, day before. I can't remember, one day. But yeah, it's a good option and three per day are well worth doing. So that's good. And we have an eight... 83 times 10 I did not expect today. That is a nice little option. Um, Advent Calendar upgrade again. Although we don't open a door today, it's always worth putting this in because it plays to the long-term benefit. Gets everything done. So let's get that out of the way. Ka-ching. Advent Calendar upgrade done. So what is the... Uh, yeah, there we go. So let's just go across. Let's just bookmark that Clive one. Here's that and done. So what is the A3 by 10 going to be? I didn't see if it was one or two squads. It is one squad. So thinking a team of the week or am I thinking with like an 87 or something? It's going to be one or t'other, but which one is it going to be? 83 with the team of the week is not too bad at all. I think it's the, that's the same as the previous price. Um, we're going to put... I found this guy. I was very tempted to upgrade him. He's not... He's more of a crouch than anything else. He's six foot five. Big strength, big jumping, big accuracy, decent stamina. Composure and reactions are cane-like. The pace is good, the agility and the balance are awful, and the curve, free kick, actually crossing are awful. So he's a big lump up front. But Dutch means he'll link, and I was very tempted to do an upgrade on him. But didn't, went with other ones. So let's just build this squad. So we've got one to do already. So uh, where are we? 83s, 83s, here we go. Uh, let's start at the top. But squares. O'Hara, Ericsson. Well, um, two 82s and then the rest 83s. One, two, two, three, and one more. Ooh. Mm, mm, let's go, Alba. And let's just use him as a test. So that's 83, and then that brings it down. So we need him in. Okay, let's go. Cool. Where's the test? Lovely. It means I'm going to have to do some more objectives, do some more gameplay before I actually can do the full thing again, because I've just used basically all of my 83s there. But we've got one more upgrade to do there, so we'll use another one of those. Obviously, if you're, if you're lucky enough to have the Team of the Weeks to be able to do them, it's worth doing... And here is the Daily Dynasties Challenge. Again, we have the Mega Pack, so it's the one where we need the full nation. So, um, I can't remember which league I was going to use this time. Sorry, which country I was going to use. That's not enough. That's got six I could use. No. Obviously, I'm going to have a lot of French because of the French League stuff. Yeah. Hmm. We may have to do some more games before I can do it. Brazil might. I know they're all French league, aren't they? That's the problem. Oh, one. Yeah. It's a problem. You collect French league players for the French league SBC, and then something like this comes up that's going to hit daily, and then you've got to realise you've got to like put a nation aside. Just to make that easy for you on a daily basis, knowing that it's coming up. Um, no new icons, which is no surprise. So, we have D Dynasties, SPC, um, Cliverts, Justin Cliver, the 83 by 10 upgrade. Um, daily Dynasties, SPC, which is the one we just looked at. The new Evolution, which is the one that costs, but it's, it's a new Evolution. Um, and the Daily Dynasties Objective, uh, which is fine. And... The FC Pro stuff, which is there as well. So we'll get some coins for doing the Maldini bit. We'll get the new Maldini card. Um, but let's go open the 83 by 10 and we'll end the video there. Obviously, we'd love to get to see the new 
um, pack opening dynamic thing for... Oh, what's this? It's going to be a combo Libertadores, isn't it? Always gets me. Always. The, non, the non-gold the non opening just makes me think every time that it's like a special decent card. But then you get Rojo or Cavani or um, Armani or something. Right. 83 by 10 rare gold players pack. Let's, fingers crossed, we want one of those shiny snazzy things which we don't get. It's Saka or Mead? We don't know. It's Mead. That's the best one. It's a double. It's a Mead and a Pajour. Well, that was a very quick double walkout. Normally, they kind of we didn't walk, actually walk out, I guess because they're level rating. And that is not a bad pack at all. That Rord I've not seen before. Alibar I haven't got before. I've got his inform, but not his normal one. And to Pi, we can go use... Oh, he's tradable as well. Two and a half. Okay, we'll put him on there above price so that he doesn't get out anywhere. Uh, let's see if any of those cards actually qualify for the evolution, <laughs> which they might do. They might actually do. Um, and then, yeah, I'll end the video there because that is what we got for today. So, rare defender upgrade, which doesn't have to be a defender. We could use Beth Mead because she is 87. Pace is two below the requirement. Defending is nicely between the requirement and she is rare. Alba. Alba. Pace is four below. Um, so, what would he look like? To be fair, he's pretty awesome anyway, but I do already have the uh, his inform. But him with an intercept plus and anticipate is a bit mad. Oh, I guess the you the what the requirement of no playstyle plus is has to be zero because it gives a playstyle plus overall. That weir is good as well. That'd be good. But Mead as an 87 already and then up to an 89 has got to be the choice, really. And that's a bit of a weird pick, putting it on a right winger. But I think that's what I want to do. Five-star skill moves, high, high work rates... I don't it don't I don't think it makes much sense, but I still want to do it. If if you see what I mean. She's not a defensive card at all, but I still want to kind of do that. I might have to. We'll see, we'll consider. Anyway, yeah, that's what's new today. Day the Dynasty's objective, SBC, new Evo, the 83 by 10, and Patrick Clivert Dynasty's upgrade. We'll end the video there. I've talked for too long. Thank you for watching. I appreciate you clicking on this video. Good luck with your play, your packs, your picks, and I will speak to you this time tomorrow. All being well, have a lovely weekend. Hope it's not too cold, wet, windy where you are. Thank you for watching, and goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs>